Hey guys, today I'm doing a summery makeup look because it is summer in Australia or there's like less than a month to go till summertime and I really love summery makeups with a really bright hot lip and I'm going to be using a really nice orange shade today more like orangey red but it's so fun and I love wearing this color with bronze complexion and eye eye makeup so I'm gonna get right into it and I'm gonna start with my primer I'm going to use my bourgeois happy light matte primer now I'm gonna use a pore vanishing serum and this is the Inoxa skin perfecting pore vanishing cream and I just got way too much but that's okay because I've got tons of pores that's too much but you can actually see this actually filling in the pores. It's pretty cool stuff. It literally fills them in. It's very, very cool stuff. I'm gonna use my Makeup Forever HD foundation. Aussie girls always ask me where I get this stuff and I bought mine at iMats two years ago. Then I'm going to use a stippling brush to blend all that in. Then I'm going to use this angled concealer brush from Sigma and my YSL concealer. Then I'm going to use a setting powder. This is my Powder Universal Natural Finish Loose Powder by Chanel. I'm gonna use the powder puff. Then my eyebrows, I'm going to do them with this little pencil by Lancome, and I'm assuming this is a brow pencil. It says Le Crayon Sourcils, Sour Sills but it's got a spoolie on the end, so that's why I'm assuming that it's for eyebrows. It's a very warm color, but that's okay, because I've dyed my hair lighter. That was ages ago now. I don't know why I'm still talking about it. Now I'm going to prime my eyelid, and I'm using the um, L'Oreal Decree. Sounds like L'Oreal Primer Potion, but nope. Now I'm taking a matte bronzer on a blending brush. This is the Benefit Hauler. And I'm running that through the socket and blending it out really, really well. I'm also gonna go under the eye. Now I blended that color out really far, I know. That's because I want the darker colors to fade out into that, that color. So that's why they're so sort of low and high on my brow. I can bring it down later if it's not looking right with a matte bone colored eyeshadow. Now I'm going to take a bronze color. This is called Bronze and it's a micro shadow from Makeup Store. Pat it close to the lid, or I should say close to the lash line. Blend it up a bit. Then I'm going to take the Balm's Bahama Mama bronzer. That's a darker bronzer, so I'm gonna use that through the socket. under the eye again. Now I'm taking a dark brown. This one's just from my um, Inglot palette. I'm going to use that in the outer V. Now I'm taking an orange eyeshadow. This is called Sunrise and I'm patting it into the inner corner and blending it into the bronze. Now take the bone eyeshadow that I sort of mentioned earlier and Drag that or place it under the brow bone. Look at me using a little sponge applicator. It's generally taboo to use these, but I quite like them sometimes. Now I'm gonna take the Maybelline Eye Studio Gel Liner in charcoal, and I'm going to line the top lash line. Then following down from the lower lash line, draw a very well, started out as a small wing, but knowing us, it'll get bigger and bigger as we try to make them even. Now I'm going to apply mascara, and you can use any mascara, but I'm going to use the Makeup Store Rotating Mascara. And I'm just going to put the button to, what's that? That's anti-clockwise. So that's pretty much the eyes done, except I'm going to put on some fake lashes. These are the Mink Lashes, MYNK. Okay, so it's the eyes done and the lashes run. 
Now to the rest of my face, I'm going to use my Bahama Mama bronzer. I find this like a real tongue twister to say, Bahama Mama. It's like so many ma 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 ma. So I'm using this as a bronzer, which is its primary purpose. <laughs> Just on my big um, dome headed, uh, what do you call this? Tapered face brush. Then for cheeks, I'm going to use the Tarte Tipsy Blush. Then I will line my lips with the NYX Orange Lip Pencil. And then the lipstick is the OR418 Lipstick by Shiseido. And it's like an orangey red with shimmer in it. It's got to be one of my favourites. It's just... It's like a party lip. And so that is the finished look. So I hope you like this makeup look. I really love it. Thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to leave my video a little thumbs up and a comment. Let me know what you thought. And I'm about to go to the post office. Gonna look really overdone for the post office, but whatever. Uh, hope that you liked it. And I'll see you in the next tutorial. Bye.